All right, welcome back. Dream Z here. Going to get down to brass tacks here. Pound out this tutorial video on how to make your own cigarettes. Very simple. Nice and easy. I did find something funny while looking at these bags here. I let you know, warning, this product can expose you to chemicals including tobacco smoke. Huh. Well, I was just going to eat it, but if they're encouraging me to smoke it, I might as well. And I'll show you how. All right, first thing first, you're going to have to figure out what kind of cigarette you're planning to make here. You either get a menthol, you get a regular. Don't have it on hand right now, but you get a smooth cigarette if you feel like being a smooth operator. All right, once you figure out what kind of tobacco you want to use... You're going to have to figure out what kind of tube you're going to be stuffing that tobacco into. Those also come in the same basic variety. You got your smooth. You got your regular. If you're a cool cat like me, you're going to go with the menthol on menthol action. You're going to be in flavor country. You're not going to know what hits you. Right? Once we figure out the tube situation, we're going to need some kind of machine to stuff these tubes full of tobacco with I would highly suggest if you're just starting out to get a premier single sliding action tube loader look at that beautiful bolt action it's not messing around here I'm making a mess on my table I'll tell you that but I would suggest doing this now I have 15 plus years I use the crank operated machines I'll tell you absolute garbage but if you feel so inclined to go that route go ahead but be forewarned they're terrible all right we'll get down to brass tacks not messing around here i'm gonna pound out some uh cigarettes gonna get your tubes out of the box we'll lay those down there whichever way you please get our menthol tobacco ready to roll Get a nice pinch, a nice handful out of there. Look at that. Perfect. Now, sometimes these will be all banged up and crinkled. Just want to look at that. Now it's nice, ready to roll. Gonna put this, slide it right, nice and easy. Maybe get some twist in action. Sometimes that helps out. Get your tube loaded, ready for action. Now, this isn't really. A scientific measurement you just want to get a feel for it it's gonna take you some time to figure it out throw that in there get some slide action look at that such a beautiful cigarette we got here tamp it down a little gorgeous golden harvest all right we'll slow it down for this next one I'm kind of it's quick on that but we'll put the tube on the nozzle, give it a little twist action, make sure it's on there nice and tight. And sprinkle some wonderful golden harvest, menthol tobacco right in there. Now I like to do that, tamp it with my finger, just get some rolling action there, pound it down. You got a tamper built in, it's wonderful. Go ahead, give it some slaps there. Look at that. Mm. Beautiful. Nicely packed cigarette. Ready to smoke. Ready to enjoy. You're already basically in flavor country. Might as well fire it up. We're not going to do that right now. But, you know, very simple. Easy stuff. Now, once you get down to the bottom you're going to start dealing with some crumbs and I suggest once you're dealing with this little fine particles of tobacco here you just get rid of those you know unless you find the idea of driving down the highway you know 75 miles an hour getting a nice hot cherry right in your crotch I suggest the crumbs you just get rid of them now you're thinking to yourself, wow, I really need somewhere to go with these cigarettes. Well, 
that's when Salvation Army comes in or Goodwill, anything like that. You get yourself a nice little tin. Got your pretty perfectly packed, perfectly rolled cigarettes here. Throw them right in there. Get yourself a nice little lid, throw it on top, keep them nice and fresh. Then you're going to ask me a question. Well, what am I going to do with them? I need to take them with me. I can't take that big ass tin with me. Well, you go to your local grocery store, get yourself a nice little box of Altoids here. Look at that. Ready for action. I tell you what. I think they're like two for five dollars. We're saving money here. We're all about the Benjamins. Well, we'll get one more roll in here. Very simple. A little twist action. Sometimes it helps. Take our tobacco here. Look at that. It's beautiful. Sprinkle it in there. Use our fingers. Get it perfectly in there. A little tamp action. A little hand. little finger holders there. Slide it out. Look at that. Beautiful. Perfectly rolled cigarette. Now, Dreamsy has a lot more tips coming at you. Going to be smoking a lot more vintage, classic, antique, whatever you want to call it, cigarettes. So please stay tuned. Like, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. All right. Well, have a wonderful day.